right, thank you very much, Don. And look who I've got with me this morning. This is Katia Versalis, a uh, professional ballroom dancer here in Vancouver. How are you doing today? I'm really good. How are you? Good, thanks. You must be very excited. Katia is just about to take off in a plane tonight. You're heading over to England to take part in a show called Strictly Come Dancing. That's right. It's basically the UK's version of So We You Think, or no, of uh, Dancing, with, Dancing the Star. with the Stars. Sorry, So You Think You Can Dance was on last night, too. Did you watch that? Um, I didn't watch that, but I'm a big fan of that show. They're all good shows. Okay, yeah. so talk to us about, uh, well, I guess maybe we should start off with a quick look at some of your work. Of course, you may remember Katia from this very iconic scene in the world of uh, movies and dancing. You're dancing here with Antonio Banderas yes. in Take the Lead. This has been named as one of the most well known or iconic uh, uh, scenes or dance scenes in movies. Talk to us about this scene. How, is, how cool is that to be in one of those most, most important scenes? I, I absolutely loved it. I had no idea when we were filming that or doing it that it's going to have such an effect on the dance world and how, you know, it was going to basically the image for the film is going to be taken from that scene. But I'm very proud of it. I've, I worked really hard and trained for it. I was actually very sick that day, too. You don't look sick at all. How was Antonio? <laughs> he was amazing. You know, Antonio, every day when he came to practice, he was so focused, so present, um, just incredible person to work with. Did you have to actually train him how to do these moves? Yes, of course. <laughs> I mean, I know it looks flawless now, but yes, uh, I did spend, um, we spent quite a few weeks and hours in the studio training and perfecting it. And That's good, and a good warm-up, though, for this show coming out here. So, Strictly Come Dancing, uh, talk to us a bit about this program, what it's all about. It's a fantastic show. It's basically on the same basis of Dancing with the Stars. Uh, actually, they created it first in England, in, in London, and then it took over kind of around the world. But basically, it's six professional uh, female dancers, six professional male dancers, and then 12 celebrities get paired up and compete for uh, the, uh, the Strictly Come Dancing Cup. And you don't know who you're paired up with just no. yet? No. I think mid-August, there's the first Greek filming. I think it's their film as they want to surprise the surprise reaction, so... Any, who would you, who would you die to dance with? I don't know. I think, um, Gordon Ramsay would be kind of fun. I'd like to kick his ass on the dance floor. <laughs> Dawn has a huge crush on Gordon Ramsay. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> If you could put in a good word for us to have Ramsey come on Breakfast Television News in Vancouver, okay. we'd really appreciate that, okay? See okay. what you can do. Uh, so how much training goes into this? Because uh, dancing, it, it may look, a lot of people don't really know this, maybe, but it's such a challenging sport, really. It's a glamorous sport. It's very challenging. You know, to make it look so easy and so effortless, it takes many, many hours of training, of perfecting choreography, technique, uh, moves, and especially dancing with a partner is one of the hardest type of dance you can do. When it's a solo, it's just, you know, it's just you, you have to worry about. Partner, you have another person, another body right next to you that, you know, and you have to sync your moves together and make them look perfect. And you can get some pretty serious injuries as well. Have you injured yourself dancing? I, I have had some injuries. I've been very lucky not to have quite so serious of an injury, but I was nursing a bit of a little knee injury a couple of months ago, and that was fine. But, but it's very scary, you know, as a dancer, your body is your temple, and something happens then. That's not good, is it? No. Okay, so you're going to stick You're gonna stick around here. By the way, you're going to be blogging about your uh, trip over to England if you That's want on right. your website. Yes, um, my website is uh, www.katiavirtualist.com and all of the footage, blogging, all, all the information will be on that site, so check it out. What a cool experience. Okay, we'll post a link to your website on our website at btvancouver.ca. Right. So coming up in just a little bit here, you're going to teach the BT hosts here how to do some tangoing. That's I'm in right. my tangoing outfit. Did you notice that today? The red tie. Yeah, not my, my blackjack dealer outfit. This is actually my, <laughs> my tango outfit, believe it or not. Uh, we're going to learn the tango here with Katya coming up in just a bit. After the break, we'll check in with Greg Harper at the Abbotsford Air Show. Stay with us. 818, it's Friday morning, everyone.